Yeah, so we've been looking at um, robotic operations for a couple of years now. So the way the robot works is we actually map the route and then it um, follows based on GPS coordinates within centimeter accuracy of where the path is. So it was a big game changer for us in terms of um, using robotics. So currently right now the Snowbot has a broom on it so which can handle up to about three inches of snow. Public safety is probably the biggest concern we have. The machine is only going a couple miles per hour. It's got you know, the infrared and LiDAR and cameras and push bars on it that will shut it off, plus emergency disconnects. Uh, this last snow event that we had, we put it on the St. Green Greenway between Sunset and Hover. And people, it interacted with people, actually people just like any other piece of equipment went around it. The Snowbot will have a MoDeck that's going to come with it here this summer. We spend about $850 per acre annually to maintain turf in the city. The robot does it between $3 and $5 annually. It could have a major impact on the amount of dollars we're spending to do maintenance. A lot of people go, like, well, you're, you know, you're taking jobs away. We're not. It's just changing the focus. It, what it does is it frees time up for, for employees to really work on things that you need technical skills to be able to do. Just from a financial perspective, it's a, very, it's a game changer.